everybody, welcome back to a brand new episode of Minecraft with yours truly, the Hermit Hood. How you guys all out there doing today? Alright guys, I got Optifine installed, so be sure to head on over to uh, Optifine.net if you guys want that. Uh, windows on the house, they're looking pretty awesome if you do say so myself. I'll take you guys inside and show you guys what that looks like here real quick before we get started for today's episode. We're hitting all the wrong keys. Uh, here we go, let's head in. Oh, if I can hit it in the right, right way. Um, windows, yeah, the connected textures for the windows, they look nice, I got the fast grass on. Um, don't worry about too much what's going on in the back. I got something for another episode for back there. Um, here in the front yard, for those of you guys that are just tuning into the channel, um, that's our sheep farm over over there um, a little bit of a cozy house for him to keep him nice and toasty um, except for this little fella over here he's been producing some wool for me for today's episode let's see here how much wool do we have in there oh yeah quite a lot let's grab all that out of there and what we're gonna be doing for today's episode is working on our snowman he needs a top hat and I also need to give him a cane to, uh, I want him to be able to get, give him a cane to hold. So we're going to have to gather some wood up for that. And I think on the top of the cane, you might as well call it a staff. I want to be able to put some bling bling on top of it. I don't have any diamonds, but I do have one piece of, we might be able to make one uh, amethyst block and put it on there. I should have a whole lot more, but I left that all the way back at home. But uh, this is for Christmas 2021, and I do want to be able to put alongside this hillside here a bunch of villager houses, and I'm going to have to drag them quite a distance to bring them here from all the way back at where my original base is and that's going to be that's going to be quite a bit of work so for right now guys what do you say we get here on top of our snowman he's got some booties on him guys he's got some boots keep him nice and going you know you, you know he's got to stay toasty but at the same time i need to get up there so what do you guys say we get up on top of our snowman here? And can we get up there? I don't know how high we have to go. I don't know how high we have to go. Okay, um, all right, we're on top. Awesome. Now, there is a way up here from the bottom, and that's going to be a way up from the shop. Um, I got a, I got a uh, plots up and open for right now, and what I'm going to do for right this moment is I'm going to bring in from the center this thing right here. Because on each port of each point of this, this thing has to go out roughly. Um, I gotta count the blocks for it, but I'm gonna go ahead and set down my bed for right now. That is not a bed. There we go. Area. Oh, look at this, guys. I I like to use dramatic skies, and what it does. Look at the moon. How nice it is when it comes up. Oh, that looks nice. That looks nice. And take a look at the sunset. Oh yeah. All right. Let's take a nap. That does look nice. Now let me see something here. All right. I got to do the circle going around this thing. So let me see here. From the center point, which is right here, I need to go. Um, this will count as two three four five six seven 
8. Then we're going to go over by 2. Over by 2. I hope this is the right way. Alright, this right here counts as 2, so pop that out. Alright, so 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And I'm just going to get this circle built. Alright guys, I got that circle built. What I'm going to do now is I'm just going to fill the thing in. And I'm going to be careful because I want to keep this top portion open where this side goes up. What in the world am I doing? I got this right here. Uh-oh. It's starting to snow. There we go. Let's grab our bed. And we're just going to start to fill this thing right here. I don't care if it snows on top of the hat. But... Really? Just not yet. Alright, let's go ahead. Let's get this thing filled in. Coming across. Oh, there's already something there. I couldn't tell. See, that's the tricky part about this snow. You can't tell. It's an even snowier, guys. It's even snowier. It's a snowy update, so you got to work with the snow. All right. So let's see here. Um, let me look at this. All right, guys. So sorry about that there. I'm continuing to work on this. What I did is I did a double layer down there of the circle. Um... I did one layer of the of the black right there. I did the yellow right there. It's a two double layer. We're going up together right now, so we're. I don't know. I'm not sure how high I want to make the hat. And what just happened? Yeah, I'm not sure how high I want to make the hat. But uh, let's, let's just see what we can do here. It is a top hat. So let's just see here. Um, I wish there was a way I can. Well, let's just see here. I think maybe one, one layer. All right. Let's just do one more layer right here. And from the inside of this thing, it will be hollow. Okay. It'll be hollow on the inside. So we're just going to go ahead, we're going to cap it now. And let's get down and see what it looks like. There we go. And where's my scaffolding at? Right about there. Works for me. Hey, I can always make more. Let's just go down nice and careful. Ouch. I hurt myself on your button, dude. All right, we got 62 of them back. Out of all of that, we got 62. All right, get this out of the way. Come on, come on F1. 
All right, let's back up. Let's see what it looks like. Haha, <laughs> I like it. I like it so far. All right, I want to see your whole top hat. Are you really going to make me go into this? All right, four. All right, that's it. All right, let's see what you look like. Let's see what he looks like. <laughs> so far, so good. I like it. I like the snowman. I like the snowman. All right. We got to give him a... Uh, we have to give him a... Uh, we have to give him a staff. A, a cane or something to hold on to. I'm thinking we take the cane and we add it maybe over here on the right or we add it off to the left whichever seems to be the highest and no the lowest part the lowest part is where we would add it because we want him to look like he's waving hello so we're gonna put it over here on the low side we're gonna give him a cane right over here on the low side so that our snowman looks like he's waving hello to everybody he kind of looks like he's wearing some shades right now <laughs> i love it all right let's get down all right let's get down and get back into survival mode all right there we go so there we go all right so yeah i forgot about that little shortcut you can f3 f4 i just needed to uh take a look at that so yeah i do use cheats enabled just to uh just for viewing things and taking some screenshots mainly for some other re mainly just for that so his toes they're like looks he got snow feet so we gotta keep him nice and you know hello hello good uh -huh. sir how you doing today you got anything of value uh -huh. you got some hermit heads uh -huh. you got a water of uh -huh. really blue ice that reminds me, I gotta do a pumpkin farm. I mean, huh? ice farm. Thank you for reminding me. Goodbye. Um, yeah, that's another thing I wanna do out here. Ice farm. Ah, forest. That's my snow farm. It's temporary. It's temporary. All right. So let me get some materials together and let me uh, come out here, guys, and we'll build a uh, stuff thing. All right, guys, so I'm back over here, and I'm going to try to go for a twisted. It's going to be twisted going about a partial way up. We're going to use a mixture of spruce and dark oak. The dark oak is what we're going to use for going up and around his arm. It's going to go up like a cane straight up through the center here. So let me see if I got this right. Am I straight in the middle? Hopefully right about here. Um, all right, let's see if this is the right spot. And what we're going to do is we're going to go the whole way up. Uh, I wish I had Feather Falling 4 right now. Okay, cool. And we're going to go across. And from here, okay, let's see here. Can we make this go across? Um, bring this up. Knock this piece out. Bring this piece over. Drop down over here. and have it drop down right about here and i'm I need to it, 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 ouch that took away most of my life okay i need to get back up there now oh my gosh that hurt <laughs> that hurt okay like ow totally ow can we sleep already I think he sucked on his bottle already. Okay. Uh, 
get rid of that crap inside my chat. All right, let's see if we can aim this properly. Up a little higher. Okay. This is where it gets interesting. Okay. Awesome. All right, we got the bling bling on it. And we're going to get all this out of the way. Get that out of my hand. And can you see the purple gem on it? Yeah. Awesome. Okay. So now I'm going to take these spruce logs after I get a little bit more food in my belly because after we got hurt there, ouch, that really did hurt. Uh, we're going to go boom. You know, let me, let me go strip these things. Let's go strip these things. Let me use my data pack for this, and we're going to strip these ones. But I think it'll look better. I swear I just hit that button. So what I did to uh, help me strip all my logs a little bit faster is... Okie dokie. Um, give me a piece of this. Give me three pieces of stone. Open this thing up. Give me a stone cutter. There we go. Now let's go try this. This should be the 4x4. Four four. If not, then I'll... You know what? I'll just do it. There. Okay. We're good. We're good. We're good. Hopefully this should be enough to get me up about halfway. So what we got is we have the uh, solid grain. And if I start like right about here, then bring it up. Then bring it up again. And all I have to do is just staircase my way up this thing. No, not right there. Not right there. All right. So I'm going to staircase my way up this. And what I'm going to do is add staircases on this as well. So that it looks a little bit more, well, how do you put this? Twisted. All right. We're getting there. If that can stop. And I don't want to go the whole way up to, to the top of this thing. Um, I'll show you guys when it stops. Because when we get so far up there, I'm going to strip what I can of the dark oak. So that it looks more like a handle. All 
Okay, I think this is where we're going to stop at. We're going to get up on top of this. And from where this is, I'm going to strip this one and strip this one. So that it looks like there's a handle there. So we're going to go ahead and strip that and leave all this just the way it is. Now we're just going to go ahead and come the whole way down. And hopefully not get hurt in the process. Well, it, it happens. It happens. But it's not as bad as it was. Okay. Um, I need a workbench. And spruce wood logs. Turn those into stairs. And just go like this the whole way up. That way you still see the stripped side of it. And you also see the bark. At least that's the hope. Perhaps the dark oak wood would have worked better to accent it, but... We'll see what it looks like when we're, when we're in. Okay, let's get up. Let's get down. Now we actually have a staircase that you can actually scroll up and down with it. <laughs> awesome. So now if you wanted to walk up the cane, you can walk up the cane. Let's drill this inside my mouth. Let's go look at it. Gather the bed. Gather the workbench. And let's go have a look. Oh, that doesn't look half bad. We got a twisted cane on it. The wood is stripped. He's got something to hold on to from the looks of it, because if you actually think about it, where he's holding on to it is, you know what, if I just remove this thing right here and put that, here, I'll show you, um, F. turn that F3 off, turn the F3 off. Okay, so if I just come up here and remove this little bit of a piece and bring it up here, strip this bit, bring it up a little bit higher, we can take this amethyst we have and we can just put like a little bit of a scepter right here on top. I don't know. I think he looks pretty cool. I think he looks awesome. That's her. You know what? I'm going to leave it be. I'm going to leave it be. I like the way he came out. He looks pretty cool. And I want to hear from you guys. He's got the impulse hat. <laughs> He's got the really cool hat going on. He's got the walking stick. He's got his what He's got some really cool things going on down there from below. I think he looks pretty cool. Our snowman looks like he's pretty comfy and I'm happy for him. Really, I am. He, that is, I don't think I could have done any better than that. For the first snowman ever, he looks awesome. 
and you know what I think our villagers when we move them in here we'll say this is what they built and we'll say this is what they built and this is what they like and this is like their statue to commemorate their own village they built this snowman because it's what they love I like that and it sounds like a sweet ending to the episode. We'll, we'll actually add a little bit of lore to it, okay? We'll add some lore to the area, all right? Our villagers that live in the area, shut up, music. Our villagers that we move into the area, all right? They eat potatoes, they eat root of baga or whatever in the world the red stuff is. Be Beetroots. Okay, they eat they eat beetroots. They eat. I wish we had rutabaga in the game. That would be awesome. They have uh, beetroots. They have their potatoes. They have their pumpkin pie because it's it can grow here. On it can grow here. Um, <laughs> it's just a thing. Pumpkins can grow here. Um, we'll actually set up something for that. Uh, I do want to build a garden center for out here. Okay. These two crops, potatoes and beets, they are winter hardy crops. So I kind of like the concept of being able to grow them out here. So I do want to build a garden center for them and probably do a uh, actual farm for these guys as well however they're going to need a uh, garden center for them pumpkins usually grow downhill not left to right or on a flat surface like this but this is minecraft what do you know what do you know um, <laughs> um and they built the snowman to commemorate their area um the the way station is gonna move it's going i got somewhere else for it we do need to build an ice farm for it because these are the snow people and they have their own way of doing things. These do not do not belong here. The ice farm is probably going to go back in this area. Um, that way we can make blue ice and all that other stuff and things. So some of this stuff and things out here, we're going to remove it. I mean, I do got a lot more trees to chop down. Um, we'll probably put it but maybe back behind the uh, gardens. Okay, I got a lot of trees. The plains biomes does go back quite far that way. So building the ice farms out here may be the better concept or idea. Um, building it out this way. Build the ice farms out here. I don't have a problem with that. Like putting that stuff behind here. Doesn't sound like, ouch. Doesn't sound like such a bad idea. The snow, got, the sand gotta go. But, yeah, if we put the ice farm back here, looking out these back windows, it'll be like something that, that you can see. I like it. I like the idea. I love the concept. <laughs> and how they got here how the villagers got here and how they get to and from the area let me know should we leave this way station here should we leave it here because i'll show you guys where i'm considering to move it okay i'll show you exactly where i want to move it over here is where it comes in at okay in the winter biome kind of extends itself out this way and I want to save this area for next year for us to expand upon our winter area all of this out here is turning into snow biome as you guys can see this this stuff is all turning into snow and ice and we got grass seeds all over the place so I need to come out here with some 
a bucket of water and just remove all the grass and flowers. I need to make it look like winter is here and the crops and the grass and everything has just like withered away for the winter. And it's like winter is here. So I need to come across this entire area and remove all the grass and stuff and things and make it look like it's ready for winter. Um, look at the big mountains, guys. <laughs> That's not 1.18. This is all beta terrain. This is all Minecraft beta terrain from 1.5. All of this was generated in 1.5 and then upgraded to 1.8 and so on and so forth. It just... It, it's just the area. Um, F3? No, not F3. F1. I can't run. Why can't I run? There you go. Now we can run. <laughs> okay. We had to eat. But I'm going to leave you guys off at this. Now, what I'm thinking of doing is taking the way station and pushing it out over here in this area, like right here. Um, I don't like it being right there, and I'm thinking of pushing it out this way. And if we want to, we can build a rail line from that that'll just kind of push its way in. Well, the rail line does still have to come through here. But I'm not a big fan of the uh, palette that I picked for this. The wood and the snow. It, it just, it's just no. I built the other one out of bricks and it looks a little bit better. And just looking at this one, it's like a big no. I used the snow for the uh, this right here. We're on the green line. And it's supposed to keep continue to extend out this way. Um, I'm not sure if this is my silk touch or not. No, it's not. Yeah, it is. It, the line is supposed to extend out that way. And it goes on for quite a while before we hit the 1.18 terrain. So... Yeah, it, it just continues to go. Maybe one of these days I'll take you guys out on an adventure and I'll show you how far that goes. Um, <laughs> it's quite the adventure. It is. It is and it's all just one long line. And then you gotta hop on a boat and go through Minecraft 1. Dot, what is it? Um, The 1. Dot, 7.10 then the one then the 1.13 terrain oh, we got a lot of there's a lot of uh, changes that went through this over the years so yeah there's a long ways to go before we find any 1.18 terrain in this world um I've explored a very far out and I got a lot of homework I want to do in this world and I'm enjoying it. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day.